We're here tonight at the Phoenix Art Museum in downtown Phoenix at a Play to Connect family gaming event uh, in which we are bringing parents and children together to play video games, to talk about the connection between video games and art, and hopefully to have a really good time. In the family gaming events that we run, we implement different strategies to promote productive parent-child interactions. You know, one thing we hear all the time from parents is that their children spend too much time on video games. Most parents have this perception that video games are violent. And violent games are just one genre of video games. There are different kinds of uh, games. There are educational games, there are puzzle games that don't involve violence. So when they come to this event and we invite them to this experience where there's no violence but there's a lot of opportunities for learning, they walk away uh, with the idea that, oh wow, actually I can use video games for learning to support my kids. Ian has expressed an interest in wanting to do video game designing. So tonight when we heard about it, he was very excited for me to actually make time to sit and um, play a game with him and for him to be able to teach me and play something together. I think one of the things that our research has shown so far is that games can be a very effective way to engage parents and children together. Um, if we look at the parents and children who come to our intergenerational play nights, they're often sitting there for an hour, close to 90 minutes, totally absorbed together in the game, talking about their decisions, um, debating what strategies or you know actions to take next. I think it's fascinating to see uh, intergenerational interactions because I feel like they have a sort of their own um, language and there's so much richness into learning and conversation. So I was learning, I had to ask a lot of questions and you had to repeat yourself, right? Yeah. And you would tell me what to press and I'd press it, and then two minutes later, I'd forget to press it, right? Yeah. Yeah. So is that a C? Or would you fail me completely? C. A C. <laughs> I just graded myself. 